Karen Chandler's son leaks her and Matt Roloff's shocking living situation. And Amy Roloff is on a property hunt, moving into a new house as she plans her future with hubby Chris Marek. I will explain everything, never miss this video. Hello viewers, I am Jufian, welcome to our new video. Before going to the main topic, I would like to say, like this video and please subscribe to the channel. Dedicated followers of TLC's beloved reality show, Little People, Big World, are no strangers to the ongoing developments in the lives of its stars. In a surprising twist, the show's iconic pair, Matt Roloff and his fiancé Karen Chandler, are currently in the midst of constructing their dream home on the picturesque Roloff Farms. Yet, an intriguing question arises. Where are the lovebirds residing while their dream abode takes shape? The answers have recently come to light, thanks to an exclusive interview with Karen Chandler's son Connor. Prepare for a fascinating glimpse into the unexpected living arrangements of this LPB debut power couple. In a recent exclusive interview with the son Connor, the son of Karen Chandler, offered a peek into his mother's rather unexpected living situation. The revelation is nothing short of astonishing. Karen Chandler presently calls Matt's double-wide trailer nestled on the sprawling farm her home. This revelation might leave fans wondering about the dynamics of their living arrangements, but Connor sheds light on the situation. According to Connor, Karen and Matt primarily shuttle between their Arizona residence and the farm. During their stay at the farm, they inhabit the well-known double-wide trailer that has made numerous appearances in the show's episodes. This arrangement is temporary, serving as their abode until their new house reaches completion. Connor adds that he's currently residing in the house owned by his mother as he contemplates his future, while Karen relishes her time with her future husband, Matt. The double-wide trailer, though unconventional to some, isn't an alien concept in Matt Roloff's life, especially amid ongoing construction on the farm. This trailer has occupied a corner of the property for years, occasionally making its cameo appearances in TLC series. However, what might leave LPBW enthusiasts truly taken aback is Karen Chandler's wholehearted embrace of this trailer as her current residence. Amy Roloff is on a property hunt, moving into a new house as she plans her future with hubby Chris Marek. The Roloff family has grown, as anyone who follows Little People Big World would have seen. Amy spent over 30 years living on the Roloff farms. She used to reside at the property with her former husband, Matt Roloff, and their children. The LPBW matriarch watched her children grow up in the countryside. Additionally, the Roloff children's weddings took place there. Amy and all of us have many memories of this place. After her divorce, though, things changed drastically. The famous LPBW had to move out as a result of their separation. Saying farewell to a place that had served as a home for so many years and carried memories was difficult. She also moved out of the house and into the home of her new spouse after looking for a new location. As for their future plans, Amy and Chris Merrick are currently searching for a new residence. Amy Roloff is searching for a new home and is depressed about a lost one. Following her divorce from spouse Matt Roloff, Amy Roloff bought a new home. It happened after he used deception to get her to sell him a portion of the matriarch's Roloff properties. A large number of Lil People Big World devotees think he convinced Amy to sell her portion of the land, and for less than the going rate too. She feels bad about the choice, but it's irreversible. The LPBW star mentioned a home she intended to check out in a recent Instagram video. Situated not too far from her present residence, the estate was in a prime location. It also fit all the requirements of a quality property and was reasonably priced. But it was delayed and the couple was unable to obtain it. The loss of a suitable property, according to Amy, made her sad. She stated that sometimes things aren't meant to be in an attempt to convey her disappointment about the setback. Her spouse didn't live here when she bought the property. He moved in after they were married. The LPBW actress will continue to search though because she is optimistic. 
Additionally, since Chris is a real estate agent, everything ought to be all right for the couple. In order to learn what is available, Amy and Chris are searching for properties. Eventually, they settled in, even though at first he thought Amy had not made enough room for his belongings. Regardless, they intend to purchase a new house and relocate into a larger place with a larger yard. That is a plan that will be implemented two or three years from now, she disclosed. Regarding the LPBW star's hunt for a new space, many theories exist. She might be doing it to relocate with her spouse, Chris Merrick, to a better house. Alternatively, similar to her ex-husband Matt, she might pursue rentals as a side gig. Might this property be a side hustle? The property search is taking place in the uncertain context of a potential little people, big world season. Fans are still skeptical, even though TLC and the LPBW cast members haven't released a statement. Amy and Matt did, however, make a suggestion about a potential production shoot. The chef clarified that the channel had not renewed its grant. Hence, fans must wait. Only time will tell what is to come in the future. If the show does not continue, renting property would be a good side business hunch for the reality to star. She is also trying to increase the following of her cooking channel. We can sit back and watch whatever comes next. No more today. What are you thinking about this gossip today? Let us know in the comments and stay tuned by subscribing to our channel to get more updates like this. Thank you.